Hi guys, this is Monday, and I said I wasn't going to, I just put on my Facebook group, I wasn't going to do a video tonight because my grandbaby decided to spend a, another night here with us, which I, I'm, I'm thrilled about, um, even though I haven't gotten much sleep, <laughs> uh, I'll probably sleep all day on Wednesday <laughs> to catch up, but I decided um, his cousin, Max, uh, my first grandchild, actually, uh, is up there and they're playing cars together on a track. So, um, I thought I would come down here and do this video real quick. It's going to be a short one. I thought I was going to have two Timu bags. And one was ready to be delivered. And then for some odd reason, it left the place. And went to Charlotte, North Carolina. And so I don't know what's up with that. That is on track. And they're really questionable. Uh, on track uh, shipping is just real. They're not dependable. And, and I sort of cringe every time that I see that. That's where my order is going. But this one I ordered after the one that should have been delivered today. And, um, then I got this little, this little thing in, uh, from the same person that I ordered the live edge mold. I ordered this about two weeks ago. It takes about two weeks to get stuff from her. And these are little inserts, and I'll show them to you. I have the cup that Rose made me. And, um. Uh, We're just going to, uh, this, this doesn't have very many, very many things in it, uh, but I thought I'd go ahead and, and share this. I was going to wait um, and do the two together, but since it's going all over the place now, who knows when it's going to be here. So I, I'm just going to go ahead and share it with y'all. Uh, and some of this stuff that I got for me... Uh, and I'll show this to you. These, I don't know if I like these or not. Um, <laughs> I'm looking at them before you even know what they are. These are pillow inserts. And I got these. Because that's what I do. I have uh, four pillows. And I change the, the covers. Uh, right now they have uh, a summer um, scene. Birds and flowers on them. I have some for fall, uh, but I didn't have any for Christmas. And so I saw these, and you got a set of four. Oh, yeah, I like these. Um, you got a set of four, and these were $8 for four of them. So I'm going to hold them up so you can see them. That's the first one. And it says mistletoe, kisses, and candy cane wishes on it. They look sort of retro to me, and I guess that's the reason why I like them. And then this one. And boy, that's a retro Santa Claus. And then, of course, it says ho, ho, ho. And then I love this one. It's the reindeer. And that definitely looks like a 50s, 60s reindeer. And it just says Merry Christmas. And then, of course, the snowman. It's got the little bird, too. Can you see the little bird? Yeah. But I thought those were adorable. And they're, I think they're 12 by 12. Uh, and, of course, every one I've gotten from there has held up very well. And they're, they're finished off good. So that's the zipper part. And for $8, yeah, of course, this stuff goes fast. So I need to go ahead and get these now. And so that means now I have ones for fall. I have ones for summer. I have ones for Christmas now. And so I need to get a set for spring. And then I'll, I'll have enough inserts to change them up. 
throughout the year. So that is the, the first thing that I got. And I didn't get a whole bunch. Uh, yeah, see, this is the same thing that I showed you the last time. And, and it did not come with anything. It's this. I showed it to you the last haul video. Uh, it's the same mold. But the other one, for the same price, y'all, the other one came with, like, little uh, pipettes and um, little finger cots and little, um, I call them mica spoons. Um, but this just came with the, the mold, which is okay. I didn't know that was going to come with all that stuff either. So, um, and I didn't. I didn't realize I was ordering two, but that's okay. And I ordered this. And and quite honestly, I think I already have one of these. Um, and that's for the corners. I'm not quite sure what that is. I'm going to have to pour it and find out. Uh, and I'm going to have to pour that and see if it will work. Okay. I got another giveaway card. I don't know why they're giving me this. Uh, the, the code is 8877FREE. This is just for new app users. Uh, I can't think of any reason why anybody would be a new app user at this point. Everybody knows what Timu is, and and everybody I know uh, is already buying from 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 them. So, but if for some reason you you've never bought from Timu and you want to, then if you download the app. Um, this is a code 8877FREE, and I don't know what you get. It says, claim your giveaway within 24 hours after downloading the app. You type the code into the search bar, and, and I, I have no idea. But if you, if you've never downloaded Timu and you want to, then... Uh, here's a, a code for you, 8877-FREE. I know it's backwards. But. Oh, wow. Okay, these were a little cheesy. I am trying to open this. And it is not easy with my fingers. I'm beginning to think maybe I am allergic to latex. Because so I've been wearing gloves. And of course, I mean, some of them are latex free, but some of them's not. And, and I've been wearing gloves. So, you know what? I, I think it originally started with the UV resin. I do. Uh, I've never had an issue ever with being sensitive to anything. Uh, until I started using that resin and then it, it started breaking out. And... Okay. I bought those. And they were... Oh, they are. They're just different angels. Can you see them? I'm putting the you can't really see them good. That's what they are. Let me turn them around this way. And they're different ones. It came in a pack like that. And I, th I thought I could use them inside stuff. So I got those. And I got a bunch of these. So. It's weird. Hmm. 
And I got these to use inside of other things. So let me show you. And I put 87 cents a piece for these. And I'm going to take this pin back off. I'm going to take all that off. I'm going to take my wire cutters and I'm going to cut that off. And I got those to insert. I thought I got four of them. So I was going to do coasters. I was going to do the dragon skin, which I have. Uh, I was going to put this inside the coaster. And then I have the dragon claws. And I was going to make them to go on the outside of the coaster. Like the there's a dragon that was grabbing. Um clutching the, the coaster. Um, okay, I got that one. And then I got the... Which one? I got four of those. Um, this is the purple one. I think I'm missing one of these, actually. So I got the blue one, and I don't see the blue one here. Here's the purple one. For 87 cents. Yeah, this looks just like the other one, and it's, I, I got the blue one. And then I got a goldish one. I got all four different ones. Uh, see, these two are the same. And it was supposed to be four. And they were supposed to be all different. So, I don't know. I have to check my order. It is cold down here tonight. That's weird. That's empty. That's an empty package. Did I throw that over there? Maybe I did. One, two, yeah. Yeah, I threw it over there. It's got to be. Okay, and then these are not what I thought they were. At all. I do not like the way they look. I was thinking that was metal, and this is just a print. Oh. I don't think you can see that really good. And the closer I get, the worse it gets. And I can't zoom, yeah, I can't zoom in. Um, it comes with the chain. These were necklaces. I think I paid 98 cents for these. And I was going to take this apart, which I don't even know if I can do. I was going to take this apart and just use the inside, but I don't think I can even do that. But I was thinking this was metal, and it's just nothing but a print. And they're all that way. So I don't know what I'm going to do with it now. I have no idea. And I think I got... And these are all steampunky. Like... This is so dark, I can't really tell. And I don't remember what it was.
and that comes with the chain too. I really wanted to. Uh, oh, and I looked. You know the eyes that I got from uh, Amazon for the 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 cat, the rabbit, and the uh, the bear. I looked. I got the ten millimeter eyes, but they don't have the twelve. It goes from ten to fifteen, and I'm afraid that the fifteen is going to be too big. And I did uh, leave a comment under Julie's. Uh, video where she did it and, and asked her uh, where she got the eyes and what size, if she knew the size of them, but I've not heard back from her. Yeah, see that? That almost looks like a clock, but it's, it's not. It's a cat. That definitely does not look like it does online. I thought this was all metal. Uh, it, this is just a print inside, uh, up underneath the glass uh, thing, majig. You know, that's the same. That's a cat, and that's like this one right here. I got two of those. Then two of the cats. Two of those. What is this? I need my magnifying glass down here. Oh, that's the dragon. But then again, it's just a print. And I was thinking it was going to be metal pieces that I could take apart. And this is like the steampunky gears and stuff. I will soak these in alcohol and see if I can't get... Or I may try the heat gun first. And see if I can... Get them apart. <coughs> Excuse me. <laughs> I think that's the first time I've sneezed on, <laughs> on a YouTube video. Uh, but it's cold down here. And my nose is running. Can you see that? I hope you can make it out. And that's it. Oh, no. Okay. And this right here. I bought these, but it looks like she sent me the same size. And yes, I opened them up. And it, I ordered a small and a medium, and they look like the same size to me. They're the... The druzy like uh, inserts. But they look like the same size, and they weren't the same price. So I mean, does one look that much bigger than the other ones, y'all? I mean, it really doesn't to me. <laughs> you see Zion back there? Even height-wise. I don't know.
but we will we will see what they're like. I'll have to find something to put them in. Which at this point right now I have no idea what I'm going to put them in. But I wanted some, so I've got some now. <laughs> And I really wanted to pour those. I really wanted to pour these. I really and truly did because they were so dang cute. I mean, they were adorable. And she didn't do the little pandas. That's what are bears. Are they bears? I just don't like the eyeballs that came with it. I think the eyeballs that came with it are just ugly. But I do know that they are, the, because I watched her again to see, and, and they were the big ones. But these eyeballs are just not as pretty. And I think the eyeballs make the difference. Now, she said hers came with those fancy-looking eyeballs. But I don't understand why hers would come with all those fancy eyeballs. And everybody else's would come with these eyeballs. And this is what's on Amazon. So. And yeah, you've just got the pink or the yellow. And you don't even have cat eyes. So that just didn't make any sense to me. And part of me wants to use the googly eyes. You know, I got some googly eyes. And I thought, well, I could put the googly eyes in there. At least those eyes would move around. I don't know. That's the size that I need. I just know those are going to look too, too small. And I don't want to waste my time. And she did use UV resin to put them in. But her eyes were so much better than those were. And I'm freezing down here, y'all. So, wow, this is a short, short video. It is only. 24 minutes and uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna go pour these real quick I think because it doesn't take long uh, but I don't want to move the phone or anything and y'all have seen me pour the the polyurethane resin um, so I'm gonna just Take them out there, and and um, I'm gonna mix a uh, we'll try this one with the white. This is sort of red, and it should get a pink. Okay, for for one of them, and then I'll use uh, hmm. I'll use a brown, which will give us sort of a beige. I don't know. That's sort of ugly, right? Now, I'm going to use a blue, and it should give us a pastel-y blue. 
uh, I mean, I could dust them with mica powders. Should I do that? Should I dust them with mica powders? I'll oh, say I have so many questions now. Um, I'll be right back. Okay. I'm not going to use UV resin. I'm going to use this. And I'm just going to put... Just pour a little bit in. Uh, the top. And then I'm just putting a little bit in the mold. I'm going to put those in there. Oh, wow. Okay, these are not wanting to stay in. That's real weird. Almost acting like they're too big. That's weird. Do y'all see that? Okay. Okay, we're going to rethink this. Because they're acting like they're too big. And I've got this glue in here. So we're going to... We're going to go the other route. And we'll just say, I mean, it's just resin, right? If it looks funny, then it looks funny. But that's not setting in there good, so. But now I have to turn these all over and. Find uh, yeah, those are cute, but those are not bunny. I need uh, the round like that and that. That would be good for a cat, but I need one. Oh, okay, I found. Okay. Just put that in there. See, that fits in there better. These are going to have to dry. Oh, those look so cute. Okay. I 
Okay, let's see. We'll put those in. Okay, and then if we can find, okay, I'm not going to make you sit here and wait for me to do that. I, I will come back when I get all the eyes in. Okay, y'all, I'm back. I went ahead and poured these. Uh, the eyeballs are too small, but I took these out already. These are the bears. And this is the, the polyurethane. And I, I sort of like the, the way the green, it really took the green. I thought it was going to be real pastel -y. And this was the emerald green Let's Resin uh, uh, pigment. Uh, it's the liquid. Um, but it really, uh, it's really dark. Now it's still really soft. But yeah, these are the bears. And I need a lot of trimming on this. But that's what those look like. Now I have not taken the cats out. I have no idea. And see, I got the pastel -y look on these. So I, I don't know what I did with the green there, but uh, these are cool. It's the cat. I guess the eyes do work, but I think the bigger ones would be cuter. And they're still really soft because I just poured these. And that's that one. This is peacock. See, this is this is the emerald green. This is the peacock blue. I didn't get as pastel -y as I thought, so I don't know. Whoop. But I think they're adorable. I do like the bigger eyes. So it would fill in the whole thing. Because it's not filling in the whole thing. I don't know if you can see. Can you tell it's not filling in the whole eyeball? But they're still really, really cute. Okay, and I had some resin left, see, part of the the nose didn't come through. I had some resin left, and I had the heart mold out there, so I just threw whatever I had in these, uh, because I didn't want to waste the resin. Oh, wow, that's ugly. <laughs> That's pretty ugly. I, I will probably uh well, I don't know. I may try to do something with that, but right now it's pretty ugly. <laughs> okay. Let's see what the other ones look like. Cause I just poured whatever I had left. And of course, these don't blend, and I didn't do anything to blend them. I just poured it in. That one's not too bad. That's just like a baby blue. Nothing fancy. I like the back better than I do the 
the front but I might be able to do some alcohol painting on these uh, with my alcohol markers too. So I don't think these are done yet. And then I have the pink, which has got a whole lot of over pour that I'm going to have to get off. See, this was red. I used the red pigment. That's the thing. That's what I thought I would get. That's red pigment. But say that looks pink. I don't know what the deal is with this. This these two colors really blew me away right here. Those two colors right there. I really expected those to be light. Because this is red and it and it turned out pink. And yeah, I need to get all that off of there but I didn't I, I wasn't planning on doing those I just had the resin and I'll probably play around with my alcohol markers with these they'll give me something fun to do and of course this uh, I'm just gonna leave that in there I, I may pour some more and that was the green in the the red that I had just a little bit left over so I threw it in there um, But I do think these are adorable. I wish I had the 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 eyes. I wish I had the eyes, uh, the bigger eyes. And I wish the colors had been more pastel. -y. I I wish these two. And Ashley will love that. I wish it had been the cat because she would have loved that grain. Uh. And I sort of like the way the white popped through. And I don't know why I did that, okay? I have no idea why that did the, the way it did. See, this is the pastel colors that I thought that because that was blue and I got the pastel blue out of those. And I thought I would get the pastel green out of that sort of bluish green. And then I thought I'd get the pastel green out of that. But I didn't. I got a really dark, vibrant green. So, I don't know. I don't know. But that's the mold. Uh, I did not do the bunnies. Because I have a grand baby upstairs. And I'm going to pull this up real quick. Uh, yeah, I have a grandbaby upstairs that's uh, been very patient uh, because he knew that I wanted to get this done. But I'm going to go back upstairs and spend some time with him. But I wanted to get a video out. So you saw you saw the small Timu haul, and you know what these look like. And, and these are these are adorable. Um, but the bigger eyes are, are even uh, cuter. Um and, of course, this is the polyurethane resin. And those might, you know, I don't have a problem with that. Because the, the polyurethane resin, when it gets hot, does not warp or bend or anything else. So, th there is a big plus there for using the polyurethane resin. Also, it gives me a backdrop to really work with my alcohol inks. Because it's, it's not, uh, it's a non-porous uh, surface. And, and I can do something with my alcohol inks on these. So I will probably play around. And that's the reason why I said this thing is ugly right now. But I might be able to do something with it. And if not, I'll just use it as a filler. Uh, it's not a waste. All right. But that is it. I want to thank each and every one of you for, for coming. Um, let me get these gloves off. And... Uh, Please do me a favor and, and hit that like button for me. Uh, that's very, very important for all YouTubers. And please do that for all of us. Um, and I hope you all have a fantastic night. I hope tomorrow is even better than today was. And I hope each and every one of you take, even if it's five minutes, just take a few moments for yourself. And um, 
That's very important. It's important for you and it's important for everybody around you. Oh, uh, here you go. Can you climb up here? Mm-hmm. Climb up. Grammy's arm's hurting. Climb up. Can you say hello to everybody out there? Can you say hello? Hello. Hello. This is my precious little Ben. And I just always eat stuff, too. Yeah, he always eats stuff. Yep. I asked him the other day, I said, do you associate with me with food? And he said, well, yes, Grammy, yeah, I do. <laughs> All right. On that note, I, I'm going to say thank you, and I hope y'all are doing great, and I will see you again real soon. Bye-bye. Can you say bye-bye? Bye-bye. Uh, bye-bye.